Hi Scrubs, I hope you're well. So we're back in Star Stable. Now, we are going to go and look at the Curlies very, very soon, but I want to talk about the Quick Shop very quickly first. Um, this is only available to those in the Australian servers. If you're outside the Australian servers, it's not going to be there, okay? Um, it will be a shopping cart icon that is next to the horseshoe menu if you're on the Australian servers. And uh, the reason for this is because the Australian servers are doing the beta launch, right? which is essentially known as a beta test, where whenever a company wants to test out something, typically with software, they will give it to a smaller portion of users who will get to test it out. And it's a way to iron out all of the bugs and things, because if they launched it on all of the servers and something went horrifically wrong, then it's going to be an issue. So that is why um, it is only on the Australian servers. Now, I went on the Australian servers earlier and it's not working, okay? It's not causing anything that I can tell, but it's not working, and the team is aware of that. Um, so for all of those who've been asking and so forth about where it is, if you're not in the Australian servers, for a start, it's not gonna be there. And um, if you're on the Australian servers and you're clicking it and nothing's happening, they know about it. Um, so that's just what I wanted to say before we get started and look at the curlies. There's also a new item in the bonus shop, but we're gonna go and look at the curlies. There also is the new map, which I just brought up my inventory and said, never mind. So um, there is a new thing with the map icons here, I believe. So you can see the new limited time horses here, or you can see new horses. So we can see that there's one here. There's also one in Fort Penta here. So, right. Time to go and actually look at these new fluffy curlies. Right. So let's have a look. And this is the chestnut one from uh, the trailer. And it was the, the one that first got spoiled on um, Twitter and so forth as a spoiler. So actually, it does look a lot. It does actually kind of look curly. So it does. They're quite short. I mean, they did look short in the um, trailer now, to be fair. They didn't look exceptionally tall. We've got fluffy whiskers as well. Oh my god, how amazing would it be if we could actually get whiskers to sit out? Hello. Yes. Hi. I like the animations. Actually, they're a lot. They're quite chill. Um, all right. So that's the chestnut, right? Now we're going to go to Fargo and we're going to see the other two, and then have a a closer look at the details and so forth as well. All right. To Fargo we go. So we also have a dapple grey and we also have a Tobiano. Where's the Tobiano? I can see. Oh, there's the Tobiano. Okay. Right. We'll look at the dapple grey first. So, I actually thought this one would look really nice with plots. I do actually like, it does genuinely look like curly coat, because it's kind of fluffy looking. I like that little animation that they do. It's cute. I'm trying to figure out, do I like you more than Khaleesi's Dapple? Khaleesi, come over here a second. Um, because I was thinking I don't want to buy another Dapple Grey Horse back to back, because I have a problem with buying Grey Horses and Black Horses. They're always one or the other. That is mostly what my stable is made up of. So yeah, you're more onto a steel grey. You haven't quite got your dapples yet. You do have some dapples, but they're faint dapples. Right. I leave you there for a moment, Khaleesi, and we're gonna go and look at the Tobiano. So let's see you. I do think I quite like this one. I like the way you've actually got lighter bits to your mane as well. I quite like this one. I think out of all three colours, this would be my favourite one. And it has the two different coloured eyes as well. You've got whiskers. You do have whiskers. They have the thing with the feet like the Andes did. No, let me go look at Khaleesi here a second. Yeah, because Khaleesi's got the little fluffy... I would have actually expected some hairs. Let's see the way they have the hairs that cross the feet on them. They don't seem to have it on the curlies. Maybe curlies don't have fluffy feet? I don't know. I've never seen a curly in real life. I've seen pictures, but never one in real life. Um, but yeah, I do like this one. I think out of those ones. Oh my god, your ears! Look inside their ears! No, no, put your head up, put your head up. I want to show inside your ears. No, stop doing that. Alright, look inside. 
That's awesome. I love that. That was like really snooty. Oh, brilliant. Right, I think we're gonna get this one. Um, right, let's see. We need a name for you. We got a kitty cat with us at the moment. Um, right, we've got a name, and we've now bought that one. Um, I think out of all of them, I sort of was verging more towards the Tobianus, because we've had a lot of solid colored coats more recently, and I thought it was nice that we could get something a little bit different. Okay, so here is our new fluffy curly. All right, we're gonna take you out. So the curlies have a unique style of walking called shuffle. The special gate will not allow them to jump or break into gallop to be able to shuffle, hold down shift at the same time, increasing your speed from the walking pace. The unique shuffle only works with the curly horses. Okay. So, just kind of like the Icelandics. Right. I like that this coat is also different on both sides. It's not mirrored. I mean, it doesn't really bother me personally on the starters, but it's nice that it's different on both sides. So we'll check out the gates when we go out here and see what they're like. And, uh... Right, so there's the trot. It's quite a steady trot. Doesn't feel like it's really moving forward, but then maybe maybe you're not supposed to. Right. Just we'll get some tack on you. While we're out of here. Okay, so we have walk. Which seems to be fairly typical. Then we've got trot, which is fairly steady. I don't know if you're clipping the back of your foot there. Don't know if that was you answering yes or just saying no. Right, and then we've got counter on it. And then followed by, if you would like to go forward for me. It's a really lazy sort of almost, uh, almost a uh, git. And then, let me see your full gallop. You've got a little bit more movement going there, although I'm not sure, it almost feels a little bit disjointed. From the back it looks fine. I think they're very lazy in their gates, like they just feel like a lazy pony, the kind of pony that's like, I don't really want to go faster, and you're like, please, and they're like, no. <laughs> right, let's try it in special gate. So, from a walk, hold down shift, press forward. Look at that. <laughs> so there we have the curly shuffle. Very much like, obviously, the Icelandic tolt. Quite like that. I like the little face it makes as it's doing that. Oop, okay, that was a signpost. You tried to warn me of that, and I didn't really hear you. Alright, now I want to go and see if there is any different main styles, because I'm curious. I do like the uh, front main. But they have quite a fine tail, like there's not a lot of um, tail there. It's kind of like with Appaloosa horses, they don't have a lot of uh, tail, but I don't know with Curly's whether that's the case, but we'll go and uh, try out a new main style and just see. Alright, let's see what the different main styles look like on this one. So we have short. Kind of look a little bit odd with short. Let me see your tail on the different ones, so... Okay, that's you with a fluffier tail. Yeah. That looks almost too straight there whenever it's like that. Like the front bit here. There's no sort of merging of the different main style colours there. Wait, is there plots? Oh, there is plots. I was about to say, I was like, I thought there would have been plots, but there is. I kind of like the plots because you can see your neck better. But I don't mind that hair either. Um. I really like that animation when they stretch their head out, like they're getting the scratch on the chin. I don't know if I want the plots, because, let me see. You know, you don't have a huge crest or anything like that. Maybe we won't go for the plots and just stick with that, because if we just go back to the front here... You see... There's a little bit of merging, actually. With the main colours there. Um, less so there. Yeah, I think maybe we will just stick with the curly. 
because I really like I like the front hair. I just wish there was slightly more because of them being fluffy curlies. But as I said, never seen one in real life, so they might be I like apple so you don't have a lot of um, tail. Oh well, yeah, I haven't actually checked out your rear or your jump. We should do that. All right, let's see your jump. If we could. Oh, what was that? <laughs> we kind of just went flying into there. Hold on. This would be better. This would be better. Okay. Okay, I like your jump. Alright, let me see your rear. As well. What was that? <laughs> I was about to say, what pathetic time was that to rear? <laughs> but it did actually rear. I thought it was just going, I don't want to rear. You're not going to make me rear. But it did. Okay, let's try that again. That is the most different wear we've ever had. I actually quite like that. At first I just thought the pony was going absolutely not. Uh, that was funny. I think I like these because I wasn't sure when I saw the, um, the image on Twitter. I was like, I'm not sure if I like these. But actually, yeah, I think I do. Because um, they're quite chunky. And I prefer chunkier ponies. I don't actually know if these are ponies. I know this is like really daft, mostly like with horses and pony breeds, I know, but curlies are not a breed that I am familiar with at all. I know that they're supposed to be very good for people with allergies, but other than that, I don't know a lot. So I don't actually know if they're classed as a horse or a pony, or if they're one of those breeds that can kind of, you know, if they're under 14 too sometimes, which does happen, because you get Connemaras that 15 hands, 16 hands. I have seen a 16 hand Connemara, believe me. It was a very big horse. Um, even though it should have been a pony. So, yeah. But I like, I definitely like these. Um, one other thing I'm just going to quickly mention, obviously they are going to work on fixing that problem with the, the quick uh, shop for those in the Australian servers. So obviously if you don't have it, and you're not in the Australian servers, that's why. And if it disappears for a bit, maybe they're just fixing it on the Australian servers. But yeah, um, there is a new item in the Merlin shop, but I'm not going to go and check it out right now. But if you do want to go and get it, you can. Um, but that's it. Obviously, we've got Halloween next week, which is my favourite. My favourite time in Star Stable. So I'm looking forward to that. But anyway, let me know in the comments whether you're getting a Carly or are you going to wait for the other three colours that were shown in the trailer. And um, let me know what you think. And um, anyway, scrubs, I'm going to leave it there. I hope you said love it. Uh, bye, guys. <laughs>